Yes, it's, uh, it's uh, longer than uh, receiving. Three engineering students were sitting and uh, talking between classes. Three of you are so. When one brought up the question of who designed the human body, they wanted to know who was responsible for the design of the human body. Well, wow. three answers. One of the students insisted that the human body must have been designed by an electrical engineer. Oh, I feel this one of you. <laughs> because of the perfection of the nerves and synapses. What that means in biology, the connection between the nerves, oh, it's a very wonderful. So it's necessarily, uh, it's necessarily to do to have an electrical engineer to do that. Another disagreed and explained that it had to have been done by a mechanical engineer. Well, somebody is living here. A mechanical engineer who designed the human body. Because the system of levers and pulleys is very ingenious. The levers and pulleys, you know, what pulley is something which turns, yes, a pulley, and a lever, a lever is something you can use to pull something. So, this is mechanical engineer who has designed that. And the third one. No, the third student said, you are both wrong. Very good. The human body was designed by an architect. And what an architect is? Who else but an architect would have put a toxic waste line? to a recreation area. Do you know what that means? A bit of explanation. Do you know what a waste is? It's what you throw away. For instance, when you go to the toilet. Okay? So the waste is in the middle of the recreation area. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Another 